Yeah, I got started in Muay Thai. I believe I was 20, 20 years old. I was doing martial arts for about eight years, and my friend actually took it up. He invited me to go to his gym. I was a black belt at the time. I went there, I uh, got my butt kicked. <laughs> I think I've been in love with it ever since. It's a very, very unique style. It, um, it's no frills. And even, even the fancy moves are extremely effective. It's right to the point I find there's beauty and simplicity for me. Um, natural progression for martial arts is always take it to the next level, train harder, become stronger, and I think Muay Thai is the pinnacle of that mentality for me. Um, average day of Muay Thai starts about 6 a.m. We're going to get up, stretch, maybe have a little water, lace our shoes up, pig yawn, wonder why we're doing this. And from there, it starts between a 7 to 10 mile run, depending on if you're fighting or not. Once the run's done, it doesn't end there. Start off skipping rope maybe, half hour, hour, depending on, depending on the weather. Um, after that, shadow boxing, half hour at least. You're going to work your combinations, work your moves in the air, just try to get the flow down. It's, that's kind of like your, your blank canvas experiment. After, after a good session of shadow boxing, you know, lace your, wrap your hands, lace your gloves up, meet your trainer. Trainer's gonna have focus pads, forearm pads, a belly pad to kick him, knee him, shin guards to kick you in the face if you can, which will probably happen. And from there, pretty much the trainer's gonna simulate you getting beat up and you hitting a pad. More you getting beat up though. Western to make it to the top of Thailand. Usually you're gonna start at a smaller stadium. Um, these stadiums can run from a village festival, um, a vacation spot has the stadium. Being, being Muay Thai being the national sport of Thailand, there's rings everywhere. You would be amazed where a ring could pop up. Uh, a ring might be four posts and some twine, and you might get paid to fight there. want to excel in the, in the sport of Muay Thai, you really have to give it everything. I mean, you wake up, you think Muay Thai, you go to sleep, you think Muay Thai. It's going to take every moment of your day. Um, you got to put the hours in. All the fighters out here have years and years and years of training. Everyone's been doing it since they're a little kid. It's not, it's not uncommon to find opponents with 200 professional fights. There literally is almost no fight sport in the world that has this many, um, not only fighters, which I hear there's around 65,000 professional fighters in Thailand, but people that train this hard, this mentality. A Thai fighter's regimen is year long. He doesn't take a time off, he's always training. He's always prepared and he's always trying to hurt you. As a foreigner, I, uh, the rumor is they want to catch you before they knock you out. Um, you know, that, a lot of people aren't down to sign up for that. Um, I believe the people that do come out here um, well, maybe a little different breed as far as being mentally stable. Who knows? Um, it's the challenge. It's the excitement of it. It's um, it's it's a different feeling when you have the lights on you and the, the crowds cheering and just there's two people in the universe. It's you and him, and it's a beautiful thing for a lot of us.